Hello, City of Mississauga. Welcome to our YouTube workout. So today, my name is Michelle Kerr, and I'm going to do with you a total body workout. What does that mean? That means we're going to do a little cardio, we're going to do a little muscle, and a little abs, and a little cool down, and it's on the books. So we're going to start off nice and easy. I'm just going to march. I'm going to have my shoulders on top of my hips. We have a nice tight running arm here. I want to target technique in my warm up so that it carries over into my workout. There's four, three, two. Now march wide and narrow. So I'm going to out, out, in, in. Step it out, step it in. Look at the feet. They come right back underneath my base, which is my hips. There's four, three, two to go. Now a nice easy step touch. And it's just to reach and pull. Again, I'm warming up. I'm not going for intensity. I'm going to bring up my heart rate and my body temperature. There's four, three, two. Now let's add in a hamstring curl. So I'm gonna draw that heel to the hip. Again, press your shoulders back, open up through your heart. Reach and pull again. Now let's change this up a little bit. I wanna get some upper back. So hips, chest, hips, pull back. Now as I draw the elbows back, Feel the shoulder blades come in towards the spine and give them an extra little squeeze. A little posture muscles activated. There's four, three. Make it a change in two. Repeater knee, four up. There's four, three, two. Other side, lift, 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 and switch. Four, three, march on the spot. Four, three, Little change in two, back to that wide and narrow. So we're essentially repeating that same sequence just on the other lead leg. We wanna switch up the lead legs, because if we don't, one's gonna get really big on one side and I'll walk in circles. Hitting, that won't happen. There's four, three, two. Step touch, reach and pull. Now you should be a little warmer. Well, my ask to you is can you step just a little wider? Just try it out. If it gets too intense, just make it smaller. I provide options today so you can kind of test the waters and find out what you actually can do. Hamstring curl. Again, hips and chest. Hips, chest. Elbows down, elbows out. Down. Out, four, three, there's two. Back to the repeater knee. And switch, march it out. I'm gonna do a nice little combo here. So I'm gonna come over to one side because I'm actually working within a little square here. All I'm gonna do is just double step. So this is my base one. All I'm gonna do is layer in more movements and provide options. You take that and you train it. Four, three, I'm gonna add on a two. March forward and back. Double step, march forward and back. Double step, or march on the spot. Double step, march forward and back. Or double step and just march on the spot. Go, forward and back, march or forward and back, and I'm thinking I feel pretty good, I might be able to try one more move. So give me a, last time we're going to do the march, and then I'm going to add in a modified jack, modified jack, left, right, double step, jack, double step. Jack, double step. Watch this jack, fencing. Double step, jack modified. Jack or forward and back. Again, choose and use your options. So I'm gonna take my movements that I choose, I'm gonna stay with them and work them. So whether it's marching forward and back, making those steps bigger, or on the spot, knees higher, no matter what I choose, 
my body should be responding by breathing heavy and hard, because that's where the results are. Is it me or does that feel fabulous? Last time, march it out. Here we go, walk for three and tap. So catch your breath, nice little tap. Now if you've got room at home to move around, I suggest that you cover some floor space. So walk it in, tap, walk it back, tap. If you're feeling pretty solid right now, add a knee lift. If you're still feeling pretty good, check this out. Whew. It's not fancy. It's all basic movement. We just play around with the range of motion. Step touch. I love this next move. It can be nice and powerful. Skate ski, tap that toe behind, reach that arm across the body, tap it, tap it, tap it. If I want to increase intensity, I can get lower in the legs, or I can step it wider, I can pick up the speed, or I can puddle jump. There we go. There's four, three, making a change in two, I march it out. Now I wanna get some muscle in here, who doesn't? So I'm gonna take the leg, step, drop, lift, and back. Step, drop, lift, and back. Profile view, take a look at that front knee. As you drop into your lunge, take a peek. See that knee lined up over the ankle. Shoulders sitting on top of the hips. Long and strong, because length is strength. I'm building my foundation. I want a powerful house. You know this is gonna get better, right? Here we go. I'm gonna take the front leg back, just down and up. Down and up, drop, drive. Now focus on the front foot here. Push down through that front foot as you drive up. It's not the back leg that gets you to the top, it's the front. Down halfway up. Snuck a little bar. There it is. You feel that pressure? Down, little pulses. Lift, lifting up and out of the joint. Woo! And hold. Step it in, other side. Down and back. Are you feeling long and strong? Are your shoulders sitting on top of your hips? Draw your shoulder blades back and down. Open up through your heart. Last round, I'm gonna take that back leg, hold it back, down and up. Drop, drive to the top. Again, I don't wanna add in arms. I wanna focus on and target technique here. I want that work to land where it's supposed to. Glutes, hamstrings, quads, core. Down, halfway up. So down, half up, half up. Get nice and low into the work and then lift. Here we go. Now down and hold, give me that little pulse lift. Pulsing action. There it is, a few more. I know it's feeling tight and powerful, right? You're thinking, I hope this is over soon. March it out. There it is. Now we're gonna go into our last combo, which we started with, and it is one, remember this? And back. Remember your options. Staying with one base combination or move and just training it. Option. Again, if I'm feeling a little fatigued, I pull back, I make the range of motion smaller. I can even do this on the spot. Last time, 
step touch, skate ski. There it is. Last movement. And then we're gonna do a little core. There it is, give me a, now option. Low or lift, wider, smaller but faster, or puddle jump. Which one works for you and is challenging? If it doesn't challenge you, it's not gonna change you. There's four, three, two, march it out. Holy heart rate. Woo, I love this next move. I stole it off a good friend of mine. That's what instructors do. Over and up. Oh, little core to go. Reach, feel this side, expand. Bring the rib to the hip, squeeze. Switch sides, over and up, over and up. Make sure you're not throwing yourself up. Shoulders come back on top of the hips. Last one, I hold it in, elbows drive down. Now, remember those washing machines that have the agitators in the middle? Some of you might not. I want you to think of those. They didn't turn in circles. They just essentially went side, side, side. So I want you to think of that. Get lower into the legs. And think of that agitator. Twist, 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 twist. Opposite ribs to opposite hip. There it is. There's four, three, two, hold. Come on up out of the legs, walk it in. Sweep the arms up. Contain your disappointment, that's finished. We've got that one on the books. Tip from the hip, heel out front, nice and long through the spine. Knees relaxed, not locked. Gentle stretch, other side. You can also use for this stretch, the back of a chair. Push the foot into the hand, open up through the hip. Or a wall for balance. And work your way up to doing this without any support. And I switch, other side. And you know, it really does depend on the day, because some days I'm all over the place moving like this, and then some days I'm spot on with balance. And suit the arms up, and bring it over, round up to the back, little cat stretch, reverse it, arch it, catch, arch, cat, arch and roll it up sweep the arms up have yourself a great day we'll see you soon